Good morning, Kaiser University faculty, admin, and students. I am Manny the Marine from One to One Fitness, Soldier Rush, and Fitness on a Mission, where we take care of our first responders and veterans all day long. All right, KU, yesterday I spoke to you about embracing discomfort, all right? Kind of taking your body a little bit to where you feel a little bit of suffering, right? Discomfort, suffering, however way you want to put it. I want you to start pushing yourself a little bit more. We are on week five, all right? And you notice every single week we are taking things to the next level, okay, KU? Remember, this cardio program, you can either use it doing walking, jogging, running, or even on a bicycle, okay? This workout is modifiable to your fitness needs. But the best way to follow this program, KU, is to follow it exactly as it is printed out for you and the instructions that I am giving you. All right, KU, we're gonna take you to the next level. All right, first, as a beginner, what do you think is going to happen? We're going to throw in an extra quarter mile today. All right. Monday is either rest, run, or walk. Okay. Tuesday, we're going to step it up to 2.5 miles today. Run, walk, run, walk. Okay, you, when I talk about run, walk, I'm going to give you an example. All right. So, if you've got 2.5 miles to do, how you can start off is 30 seconds of running. Then you can go one minute of walking. Then each week you can change it up a little bit, go 30 seconds of running, then 45 seconds of walking. Then the next week, 30 seconds of running, 30 seconds of walking. All right, KU, time to go next level. 45 seconds of running, 30 seconds of walking. Then a minute straight of running and 30 seconds of walking. You're starting to understand the pattern. Just keep it going and before you know it, you're doing running all the time, and then you're ready for the intermediate workout. Okay, so on Wednesdays, KU is again, rest, run, or walk. Thursdays, we're gonna knock out two mile run, walk, okay? Fridays, we're gonna rest. Saturdays, we're gonna go for a 2.5 mile run, walk. And on Sundays, mm -hmm, we're gonna do that 50 minute run, walk. Okay, so remember that Sunday workout it's all about accomplishing the time. I want you to go ahead and take your time, find a new route, you know, do it with a, a friend, you know, who's working on the same type of program that you're working on, okay? Remember, okay, you we gotta still maintain social distance, okay? But this would be a perfect workout to enjoy with a friend or a family member. Next, intermediate, all right now, week five, okay. We are going to start out with a Monday rest. Tuesday, three mile run. Wednesday, we're gonna step it up a bit to seven 400 meter sprints. All right, Thursday is gonna be a three mile run. And Friday, we're gonna rest a little bit because you know what, Saturday, we're gonna go four miles fast. Okay, this is not gonna be a leisure. Hey buddy, you wanna go for a quick run with me? No, you gotta be push yourself. You gotta create some discomfort, KU. Create some discomfort. That's how we take our game to the next level. All right, and then on Sunday, we're gonna go six miles. Okay, so that Sunday, we're not going for time this time, we're going for distance, okay? So six miles, it's supposed to be considered a test, but I want you to go out there and just test yourself to get that six miles, okay? If you wanna walk, jog, walk, jog, bring a friend along, do whatever you need to do to get that six miles done. All right now, my advanced programmers, okay? You're the ones that have the dumbbells already in your house. You already have a bench press. You have all kinds of stuff. You got a pull-up bar, okay? I know you're loving this program because on Mondays, yes, again, we're gonna knock out three miles. Tuesdays, we're gonna do it just like the intermediate program. We're gonna do seven by 400 meter sprints. You know how to take it. Next level, every time you get out there, push yourself. You should be accomplishing those 400 meter sprints a little bit faster each week than you did the previous week. Then Wednesday, we're gonna rest, okay? Or we're gonna go for a slow run jog, okay? On Thursday, we're gonna go for a 40 minute tempo run, 40 minutes. Friday, we're gonna rest. And on Saturday, five miles KU, five miles for you advanced programmers, okay? Five miles fast. And then on Sunday, whoo! 
you're gonna have to bring a snack for this one, okay? You have 75 minute run, okay? Remember, it's not about just getting out there and trying to do as fast as you can or anything like that. I want you to look at your watch and make sure that you knock out 75 minutes that day. All right, KU, see you out there getting this thing done. Remember, running, okay? Running is a part of the program that you're getting out there, you're pushing yourself, but you can actually have some sort of a conversation. It should not be easy. It should be a little bit labored with your breathing. Fast running, no conversation at all. Get out there and push yourself, okay? Long runs, definitely bring a buddy along, change up the scenery, and just work on getting the type done. Interval training, okay? You, that's where you get faster, okay? We get out there, we pump our arms, bang our knees up, get up on the balls of our feet, and get out there and crush it, okay? Tempo run, remember, tempo run, first five to 10 minutes, we're kind of slowly bringing ourselves up, and then the next 10 minutes or so, we wanna be running at a nice, even, fast pace. And then the last 10 minutes, we're gonna slow it down a little bit. As the time gets longer, is when you're training in the middle, it's gonna get longer. So what I just said about having 10 minutes, if you're doing a uh, 35 minute, now it's gonna be a 15 minute run in the center. If you're doing a 40 minute tempo, it's gonna be a 20 minute run in the center, okay? A 10 minute warm up and 10 minute cool down. All right, KU, some of you should have uh, knocked out a 5K last week. I don't mean you actually have to get out there and go join a race because there are no races right now. You got to create your own race. You got to race against yourself. You got to push yourself. So now you should have a baseline as to what you can accomplish a 5K in. So over the next four weeks, we're going to train hard. So we're going ahead and bring that time down just a bit. KU. I love you guys. I appreciate you coming out here. This is week five where we're going to take our game to the next level. And I am Manny the Marine letting you know that I want you to create some discomfort in your workout this week. Okay, so we can take steps to the next level all the time. Remember, KU, to like us on Facebook and follow us on Instagram. I am Manny the Marine signing out and wishing you luck this week. Until next time.